hello and welcome back to my youtube channel if you are new here please be time to subscribe down below hit that little bell button so you don't miss any of my content and if you came back hey mamas today we are going to decompress okay i've been super stressed out with work which is why i haven't been able to put out as many videos as i usually do i normally do every week if you're new um mondays at i did 5 p.m but then 11 was cool at a point anyway um so this video i'm literally just gonna be chilling with y'all I just got back from work. I left for work this morning at like 8 p.m. Um, I went to get my nails done. If you follow me on Instagram, you probably voted for this design. Um, but I just finished getting my nails done and I had to run a few errands. I went to the grocery store, picked up some salmon, which I'm going to cook. Um, also picked up some wine. My favorite wine... Okay, so the 750 mil was... Ten dollars, and the the one point five liter was eight. So I was like, so we're getting the one point five, right? So I got that. So I'm gonna drink that, and also of course wind down, take a shower, show y'all that, do my skincare routine, and go to sleep. So if you're interested in that and you want to chat, keep watching. <laughs> so I was trying to decide if I wanted to cook first or shower first, but I think I want to shower first. Um, because that's probably going to take longer, question mark. Um, but I want to do like full on exfoliation and just like take care of myself. Um, I feel like when I tend to get stressed with work, I just get really, really tired. So it's not that I'm not taking care of myself, but I'm just definitely not taking care of myself to the best of my ability, if that makes sense. Um, I probably... <sighs> Should I wash my hair? don't feel like it I probably won't wash my hair just so I don't wet my pillowcase because I did wash my sheets prior to leaving for work this morning so I'm gonna have clean sheets to go to sleep plus I did um, wash my hair not yesterday but the day before so I definitely can keep this wash and go for a little bit it's a little messy but believe i can extend it so i'm gonna hop in the shower but i am gonna be showcasing to y'all what i'm using in the shower um but yeah we're gonna do body wash exfoliation i'm gonna put y'all on to my favorite product so fun fact i don't wear perfume but this product that i use in the shower keeps it on good all the time i promise you um and then we're gonna do some care and then we're gonna transition into cooking
smell fantastic. Again, that Nolas Consensual shower butter is the truth, okay? I literally smell like peaches. Don't mind my hair. Anyway, um, even though that's super moisturizing, I do like to still use other stuff too. So I have been using Necessaire's body serum. All of the products that I use from Necessaire are fragrance free. Um, that's solely because I have sensitive skin and that's just what works for me. If you do use their products, then I've heard people like the eucalyptus um, fragrance. So you can try that. I just can't believe how good I smell. These things are so therapeutic. This serum has hyaluronic acid in it, which y'all know I love hyaluronic acid. Actually, maybe y'all don't know. People on my Instagram know I love hyaluronic acid. Anything with hyaluronic acid, I like run towards it. Um, oh, and then this is the body butter that I've been using. I'm very bad at pronouncing the name, but that's her. Um, but it's like really nice it's interesting because i'm not like the fondest of the smell it literally smells like grapes but it's like super super thick super moisturizing and it doesn't break out my skin so that's like really nice so i've been using this a decent amount i put it in one of my get ready with me reels i've really been loving making those recently and I'm probably going to start making more. I actually got access to Instagram real plays, like the bonuses. So that's been kind of interesting. I literally just got accepted though. So I don't know too much about how it works or anything like that. But it's been kind of nice. I literally posted like two reels because they accepted me at the end of the last period. So I literally posted two reels in like two days. And unfortunately my reels haven't been getting as many views. But I still made like $45. So... You know, better than nothing, you know? But now we're going to shift because I want to do a face mask. And I've talked about this face mask before, but that probably would be for, like, more of, like, my OG Instagram followers. So, if that's not you, let me put you on. Alright, so this is my skincare cabinet. I eventually will probably make a video <laughs> about everything that's in here. But... We are going to be using this. She is my pride and joy, okay? All right, so this is Quisil face powder. It is, um, and it's from Beauty of the Horn. I don't know other places that you can get it. I'm sure you can. Um, but now my hands being too sticky. Okay. It is literally a powder. Literally, put it in your hand. There's so many benefits of Quisil. Um, the main one that I personally like is that it's an anti-inflammatory and my skin is actually kind of upset right now. Then you are going to, as you probably guessed, mix it with water. You're going to waste some of it, unfortunately, but you want it to become like a paste. And then you're going to put it on your face. Like, all over. I know that I've mixed it with enough water when it, like, becomes this, like, lime, like, lime, lime green color. But again, it's from a black owned business. Um, the owner is like super dope. But ever since using this, and I only use it like periodically, but um, my skin just like glows. Like literally. And you can also use this as like a body scrub too. I don't use it on my body, or I haven't 
get. But yeah. Making sure everything is covered. And then you're literally just gonna let it dry. It dry. <laughs> You'll know when it's dry because you won't be able to move your face. So while this dries, I'm gonna get my life together. I'm gonna clean the dishes. I'm also gonna pour myself a glass of wine. These are literally my favorite wine glasses. I also love the color brown, so. It's fitting, it's with a brand, um, but it's also black owned. It's from Estelle Colored Glasses. So I'm going to pour myself a pretty nice helping. I told y'all my favorite wine was on sale. I got the 1.5. This, if you like, if you like red wines, if you like, this is a sweet red wine. And it's also, it's not considered sparkling, but like it's fizzy, they say. Let me see if I can actually open this. It's a twist off. Come on, come on. Big body. No, it's not happening. What's up? It's not even usually this hard to open it. And I heard it, I heard it wanting to open. What is she doing? Oh, there she is. All right. Yeah. All right, I'm not gonna go too crazy right now. Looks like this. Cheers. Mm. All right, let's clean the dishes. All right, so I clean the dishes. You can see that I literally can't move my face. <laughs> so now I'm gonna wash it off. When you wash it off, it does turn kind of into a little exfoliant, so I'll do that. And then I will dab my face dry with one of Clean Skin Club's um, clean towels. I do really like them. Um, I've never really had an issue with um like acne i do get texture on my face which like is what i was talking about a little bit earlier um but if you are acne prone definitely look into those towels because they help um not transfer bacteria on your face um but yeah let me wash this off all right this is the type of mask that like you will wet your countertop trying to take it off <laughs> um but again, the skin benefits are fantastic. So I think it's worth the messy countertop. Oh, that's dope. So here's my skin right after. Let me turn on the light. Here's my skin right after the mask you can see that this area right here was already a little bit irritated so it's gonna be a little bit irritated because I low-key exfoliated but it like instantly brightens your face in my personal opinion but to make sure that I actually got everything off I'm also going to cleanse my face and I'm gonna go in with their oh my gosh where is it Kitty, I found it. It's also from both, um, but it's their Cosell facial cleanser. 
So I'm going to really like it. It's like a really smooth consistency. But I usually try to make a little bit of bubbles before putting it on my face. This cleanser has aloe and lemon in it as well. And I'll put all products that I use in this video in the description box so y'all are aware. All right, and this is my skin after cleansing. Very jumpy, very jumpy. <laughs> It's fine. Um, now on to toner. I've been using, again, Cloudily? Someone correct me in the comments, but they're grape water. I also use this in a Get Ready With Me video on my Instagram. And now, I actually ran out of my favorite serum from Paula's Choice. It's the o um, Omega, Omega Plus Complex Serum. I actually need to reach out to them because I need it. I need it. Let me put this back before this spills. But I'm going to... What I want. I want what I want. It is for sure dry. Hmm. I'm gonna try Coco Kind recently sent me the Ceramide Barrier Serum. And I haven't used it yet. Not it. I'm zooming out. And I haven't used it yet. So let's get an interesting consistency. You are not supposed to touch the dropper tip to anything except for the bottle so if you do that stop very interesting very interesting smell my neck is super dry what a weekend wow and you just texted us oh are we outside we outside for real. It did absorb into my skin pretty well. Okay, so then I'm gonna hit y'all with Superfood Air Whip Moisture Cream from You to the People. I love how moisturizing this cream is. Makes me so happy. All right, and honestly, I think I'm gonna end my skincare for the night with that. Um, I always put Vaseline on my lips. I'm actually, this is like the first tub of Vaseline that I literally have gone through. I don't know how I feel. I feel like I've had this for like, actually, I'm not gonna tell you. <laughs> I'm not going to tell you how long I've had it, or how long I think I've had it. Wow. Whew. So I'm moisturized. Sometimes I also put a layer of Vaseline on my face. Apparently there's like an actual word for that, but like, black people have been doing that. So, do with that what you will. But I'm hungry, so let's start cooking. In the kitchen with it. I... Where did it? Maybe we're not in the kitchen with it. Just kidding, we for sure in the kitchen with it. I picked up a salmon filet from the supermarket. I'm trying to see which way I want to cut this. Is 
that the way I want to cut it. It's fine, I guess. Um, I love salmon, and I'm gonna make like salmon bites. If y'all follow me on Pinterest, I actually have made this recipe, and I put the recipe on my Pinterest if you're interested. I think I also posted that same video that I'm referring to onto my um, Instagram as well. Basically, if anything, if you learn anything, follow me on all socials because I'll be posting different stuff on each platform. So you really can only get certain things from certain socials. Do you feel me? But yeah, it's gonna be like a honey garlic situation. I got my. Can you see me back? No. I got my soy sauce, sriracha, minced garlic, and my honey is in the uh, cabinet still. But nothing too crazy. The woman at the store, when I was getting my salmon, she said I had to air fry it. I have never, I have an air fryer, but I've never air fried my fish before. That makes me a little bit nervous, I don't know. But I know people, I know people use the air fryer for literally every day. So. But yeah, y'all. It's actually been super therapeutic. But when I tell y'all I really have been working, like, I am not exaggerating. I'm talking weekends. 24 7. I love salmon. I really hate preparing it. Like a lot, actually. I got these cute plastic bowls from Target. They're like literally 75 cents. Super easy to use. Like they're microwavable, dishwasher safe. Anyway, so this is my salmon. So I'm gonna wash her, season her. But I'm probably not gonna show y'all because if you want the recipe, I'll link the pin. I'll link my reel or the pin under this video. But I'm gonna show y'all the finished product. Our pan is a POC owned kitchen appliance kitchenware brand. I really really like their pans. I have my mom actually got me a whole set like this pan, four plates, four bowls glasses a whole set uh, for my housewarming or apartment warming gift um, I really really like this pan stop playing with me yo stop playing with me y'all see that actually let me turn on let me turn on the light oh the light was already on 
<laughs> I forgot that I don't turn my light off. That's so funny. Yeah, bro. Yeah, bro. All right, let me plate it. to lunch tomorrow. You feel me? Can't forget the bottle. The stove is off. What should I watch? Let me get the other remote. Um, Who Killed Sarah is this really, really good show on Netflix and India texted me no. India texted me that they came back <gasps> It literally just came out Oh my gosh, I'm hype I'm hype Alright y'all, I'm about to start Who Killed Sarah but thank you for rock with me This was very therapeutic for me um again i've been working a lot and it was nice to be able to take time for myself and cook for myself and you know do my skincare my body care um drink some wine and just chill out and talk with y'all so i really appreciate the space that i've been able to create but y'all have allowed me to create here on my channel um so again without further ado i'm about to start watching but i will be linking all products that i talked about in the video in the description box this recipe i will also be linking um to the pin that i actually made follow me on pinterest if you're interested in that i actually am very active on pinterest i love pinterest so much um tell your friends to watch my videos or don't follow me on all my socials instagram tiktok pinterest twitter here all of it i have a podcast whatever medium you like to consume i have it for the most part except there is something that will be coming but i have to work out the details first but anyway i really love y'all thank you for subscribing our journey to 1k is full force and i'll talk to y'all soon bye